Emotional and tense moments in court today for the man who kidnapped a teenager and murdered her parents in Wisconsin. Family members of 13-year-old Jamie Kloss relive the horror while reading impact statements directed at Jake Patterson. We now live in fear every day. Watch our backs. Have home security systems. We don't feel safe. I will say I won't let you destroy my family no more. And because of this monster, Jamie won't have her mom and dad at her dance recitals. Won't have her mom and dad at her prom. Won't come and dance. My brother won't be able to walk down the aisle at a wedding day. Um, just, uh, sorry. Um, I and my parents, they raised us just to be Good, hard-working people treat people fair, honor, do the right thing. Jim and Dace were doing the right thing, and uh, Jimmy didn't get treated fair that morning. Um, so we just ask that you impose the maximum sentences. Um, do the right thing. CNN's Gene Casares was inside that Barron County courtroom, and we actually heard from Jamie through a lawyer. Gene, what were her words? Well, well, let's remember, Jamie Kloss is 13 years old. She is not in that courtroom. The sentencing hearing continues right now. The prosecutor described in great detail how in October of last year that Jamie woke up, her dog was barking because someone was coming to the front door, and she and her mother huddled in the bathroom, in the bathtub, and they heard a shotgun blast, and they realized that her father had been shot dead. Mm and then he went into the bathroom, Jake Patterson, and he opened up the, door, the shower curtain and there was Jamie and her mother. He made Jamie get out, he duct taped her, he fired one shot into the head of her mother, Denise, in front of Jamie Kloss. So today an attorney representing Jamie Kloss sat and gave an impact statement that had been written by Jamie herself. Listen. Last October, Jake Patterson took a lot of things that I love away from me. It makes me the most sad that he took away my mom and my dad. I felt safe in my home and I loved my room and all of my belongings. He took all of that too. I don't want to even see my home or my stuff because of the memory of that night. But there are some things that Jake Patterson can never take from me. He can't take my freedom. He thought that he could own me, but he was wrong. I was smarter. I watched his routine and I took back my freedom. I will always have my freedom and he will not. Jake Patterson can never take away my courage. He thought he, control, he could control me, but he couldn't. I feel like what he did is what a coward would do. I was brave and he was not. And Jamie Claus escaped this January after being held for 88 days by Jake Patterson. And Anna, Jamie also said in that letter to the court that she used to love to dance, that she loved the things in her bedrooms, and she can't go back now, and she can't dance because she just doesn't have it in her, and she cannot even face this community as she stays in seclusion, Anna.